my name is Ruben Shipway and I'm from um, Ocean Genome Legacy, which is part of Northeastern University Marine Science Centre. We are here today because we have uh, found quite an extraordinary new species. This one is so unusual that we actually had to create a new genus, which is sort of the next level up in taxonomy. We've given this a name, it's called Lithorado abitanica and it's named for Lithorado because the family is Teredo. Litho stands for stone, so it's Litho Teredo. And Abitanica, because we found it in the Abitan River in the Philippines. This particular species is found only in a stretch of this river in the Philippines that runs about mm, three to five kilometers. That's it, the only place in the world. You can see there's a big animal just in here right now. Really cool piece of stone has just split. <laughs> you see, it's living inside this big piece of stone. This one is exciting because it's a clam, a bivalve. It looks like a worm and it burrows in stone. But this one's unusual because it's not only burrowing in the stone, it actually eats the stone. We look inside the digestive system of the animal, we find the same stone in the digestive system that they're burrowing in, and they're sort of excreting like sand. So we've got the bivalve shell just up this end. Mm -hmm. And then down this end, we've got the siphons. So it breathes and excretes through these siphons. And then these hard calcareous structures either side of the siphons are called pallets. Mm -hmm. Those are structures that are unique to the family. And what they essentially do is they close off the, bur the, close off the burrow that the animal is living in. What's most remarkable about this is what we don't know, I think. Rock has no nutrients, right? There's nothing much in there that this animal could live on. So that tells us it's doing something else. And what that something else is should be very interesting. 